it raises you another dark side of Genesis achievement guide. We'll be going for the achievement called Walking Army, which is for finding all five of War's elemental enhancements. Now, there's six total. One of them doesn't count. I don't think the one that doesn't count is called Earth Splitter, but I'm going to be showing you where all six of them are anyway. So, that being said, we're going to show you Earth Splitter first, and I'm going to show you in the them in the order that they come across to you in the campaign. So we are on the very first area in Dethroned. So if you can see where I'm marking my little cursor, right there is where it was at. You gotta make your way from the starting point up and all the way around like where I'm showing right here the cursor and you'll get in this middle spot right here to get your first one, Earth Splitter. Alright, your second one will also be one you can get from Vulgrim. So after you beat your first mission, you'll come into this area called the Void, which is like your home base. So you go up to this top stairs right here, and this is where Vulgrim is always going to be. Go ahead and talk to Vulgrim, and if you just scroll down to the bottom, you will see that he has Thunder Clap. So, with that being said, that would be your second one. So whenever you want to buy that one, go ahead and get it. I didn't get it right now because I got the static shot instead for strife but this will be one for each of them so make sure you grab both of them obviously as well all right we'll be moving on to the second one here it is weird that they have the achievement set up for it being just five out of the six but you know whatever all right another one for the actual achievement here is for the flame brand this is another elemental one. So I'm going to show you where we are at here. So Flame Brand. We are in Icebind Caverns. And I'll back out here and show you where I'm at on the map. There'll be a little fight for this chest to get to this. To be able to get to it right away. So we're in Icebind Cavern, Chapter 4. I'm going to show you where we're at here on the map in just a minute. But you can definitely tell that this is obviously an elemental because it's fire. The first one doesn't have an elemental effect. So this will be your first one that I got as an achievement since I didn't get the other one right away. So you're coming down this little area here, you can use this as a reference point, this orb up here as well for collecting some souls and it's just north of the map down there. So next one would be Death Touch. I'm gonna show you where this is at in just a minute once you back out the map. We are on DK. And I'll show you where, you are, where I'm at on the map here. It's in the epic chest, all these are usually. So, to get this one, it's a little bit of a trek. This is where you start out at right here. And you'll be making your way up to the middle of the map here, going up some stairs in this dungeon. And once you get into the dungeon, you'll spawn. Right down here, you'll need to follow this path all the way up to the right hand side and you will get it over here, an ability to be able to get to this. So once you get that ability, you'll make your way around the map where I'm pointing out. You'll shatter a crystal over here, follow this path down here, and just hop down the bottom right over here. And this is where you will get your next enhancement in this chest. Alright, so we will be moving on to the next one. Another one from Vulgrim as well called Vampire Ruin. So make sure you go ahead and grab that from Vulgrim as well when you get enough souls. Many great things Vampiric Ruin, excuse me. But make sure you grab that one as well. That will be your next one. Moving on to the next one, and your last one, which is called Vortex. As you can see, we're on chapter 11. This is at the end of it. Now, I'm going to show you to get this. This is a pain. This one's a real pain in getting Vortex.
So basically, what you're gonna need to do is come into this trickster room, which you're gonna need some keys. Obviously, either get some from Volgrim Arena or get the ones on the map. I'll have a separate video guide for that as well for all the doors if you need that. So basically, you're gonna get these keys, and you're gonna come into the trickster room, and you're gonna do some sequences of hopping around on these platforms, which I'm not gonna re-show you because it's a pain. And I got up there finally just to get the chest, and didn't know what was in it, and that is what's in it. So you'll come up here, and these invisible plates will appear on the floor. You step on them, and you'll need to cross these plates to get over there to get that chest and get your achievement. And that'll be the last one for war. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope this helped you out. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe, I would greatly appreciate that, and I will catch you around for some more achievement guides.